Michigan politicians are trying to undo a new anti-gerrymandering law. In 2018, Michigan voters passed a ballot measure to stop partisan gerrymandering. But politicians who manipulated Michigan's election district maps to keep themselves in power just filed a lawsuit to stop the new anti-gerrymandering law. More than 425,000 voters signed the petition to put this amendment on the ballot, and more than 2.5 million voters voted to pass the amendment. Politicians are going against the will of the voters. But Voters Not Politicians is fighting back to protect the law and make sure partisan gerrymandering is done for good in Michigan. This week, disgraced former Tallahassee Mayor Scott Maddox pled guilty to corruption charges. Maddox and his business partner, Paige Carter Smith, accepted at least 40,000 from Uber and undercover FBI agents in exchange for supporting local legislation that favored the ride-sharing company. The duo faces up to 20 years in federal prison and will be back in court on November 19th for sentencing. Maddox was an opponent to Tallahassee's Anti-Corruption Act, which voters passed overwhelmingly with bipartisan support in 2014. The FBI will continue its corruption investigation in Tallahassee. Californians are proving that voters are excited to put an end to gerrymandering. More than a thousand California residents are applying every day to be part of the Model Citizens Redistricting Commission. The commission is made entirely of citizens, five Democrats, five Republicans, and four from neither major party. It was formed in 2010 by a statewide referendum and is the first of its kind. The commission helps prevent gerrymandering, which is when districts are manipulated by parties and politicians to rig elections. Citizens on the commission get to draw congressional and state legislative district lines, ensuring they are fair and don't give any one party an advantage in elections.